Good morning, grade one. Our lesson today about a make a ten to add. First, let's remember together the family of number ten. The first friend is zero plus ten, one plus nine, two plus eight, three plus seven, four plus six, five plus plus five, and so on. The same numbers. Okay. So we need to use this family in this question. Look at this question. In this question, always the bigger number want to be number 10. So the first step, search for the bigger number. I have here 7 plus 5. Where is the bigger number here? The bigger number is number 7. So here, number 7 want to be 10. Okay. Number 7 say to number 5, please number 5, can you, big, can you give me the friend to be 10? To be 10? Okay. Number 5 say, okay, what's your friend? Number seven say, my friend is three. So now we decompose number five into two numbers. Okay, decompose number five into two numbers. The friend of number seven, we say, what's the friend of number seven? Three, so I decompose number seven into three. Okay, now open five fingers, close three, the friend of number seven, one, two three how many fingers are left two so now we break number five into two numbers three the friend of number seven and two okay now number seven complete the box and be ten take three from five and here how many fingers are left if i have five and close three one two three i have two fingers are left so here i draw two six circles and give three to number seven so the question will be 10 plus two this box consists of 10 circles so the question here is 10 plus two okay so i put 10 in my mind and two in my fingers and count after 10 11 12 okay let's see another question We say that the first step, search for the bigger number. Here, where is the bigger number? I have 7 plus 4. 7 is the bigger number. So, 7 wants to be 10. So, 7 asks 4 to give here some numbers. Okay? Here, we'll decompose number 4 into two numbers. What is the friend of number 7? 3. So, I write here 3. Then, open four fingers. Open four fingers. Okay. Close three. What is the friend of number seven? We say three. So close three numbers. One, two, three. How many fingers are left? One. So here we decompose number four into two numbers. Three plus one. Okay. Now the box of numbers seven are complete and seven will be ten. Here seven and three circles. Okay. And we say how many fingers are left if I take three from four fingers. One, two, three. Now I have one finger. So the answer will be 10 plus one. Okay, let's make it. I put 10 in my mind and one in my finger. Count after 10, 11. So I write here 11. Okay, and this question, we say that the bigger number wants to be 10. In this question, the bigger number wants to be 10. So first, search for the bigger number. I have here 8 plus 4. What is the bigger number? 8 is the bigger number. So here, number 8 wants to be number 10. So ask number 4. Ask number 4 to decompose it, to give her the number to be 10. The friend to be 10. Okay, what is the friend of number 8? The friend of number 8 is 2. So I write here 2. Okay, now open four fingers to, to, be, uh, to know the last number. Okay, so to know the second number. Close to 1, 2. How many fingers are left? 2. So I write here 2. So here we decompose number 4 into two numbers, 2 and 2. The box of number 8 are complete and now number 8 become 10. Here, this is number 8 and this is the 2 we take from number 4. Okay, and how many fingers are left? If I have 4 and take 2, the friend of number 8, how many fingers are left? 2. So I put here 2. So the question will be 10 
plus two. I put 10 in my mind and two in my fingers and count after 10, 11, 12. So the answer will be 12. Okay, let's see another way. If I have this way of question, look, we say that the bigger number wants to be number 10. So we decompose the second number into two numbers. Here I have seven plus four. Seven wants to be number 10. So we decompose number four into two numbers. What is the friend of number seven? Three. So I decompose number four into two numbers. Three, let's close three. One, two, three. How many fingers are left? One. So one is the second number. So I decompose number four into two numbers. Three and one. Seven takes three to be 10. And here, uh, this is one. And we broke number four. We broke number four into two numbers. Three and one. Seven be three. So the question will be 10 plus one. We broke number four. Okay, we broke number four. Seven become 10. So a hey. 10 plus 1. Okay, 10 plus 1. I put 10 in my mind and 1 in my finger and count. After 10, 11. In this question, 9 plus 6. 9 wants to be number 10. So we decompose number 6 into two numbers. What is the friend of number 9? The friend of number 9 is 1. So here, number 9 become 10. Okay, open 6 fingers, close 1. And give it to 9 to be 10. Okay, how many fingers are left? 5. So the question will be 10 plus 5. And we broke number 6. 10 plus 5, I put 10 in my mind and 5 in my fingers and count. After 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Let's see another question. Okay, here, let's see this question. 7 plus 6. 7 wants to be number 10. 7 the bigger number, so the bigger number wants to be number 10. Where's the bigger number? 7. So 7 wants to be number 10. Okay, what is the friend of number 7? The friend of number 7 is number 3. So I write here 3. Okay, now open 6 fingers to know the second number. Okay, open 6 fingers. We take 3. So close three. One, two, three. Okay. And how many fingers are left? Three fingers. So I write here three. So here I broke the six into two numbers. Three and three. And number seven now become ten. So the question here will be ten plus what? This is ten. Seven plus three equals ten. So the question is ten plus three. So I write here ten plus three. Okay, I put 10 in my mind and three in my fingers and count after 10, 11, 12, 13. So the answer is 13. This is our lesson for today. Thank you and bye.